Okay, everyone, are you ready for a Sims in Bloom legacy recap? This is, I'm just starting my stream right now. Welcome in. Hi, everyone. <laughs> All right, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So if you missed last stream, we built this entire house. It's on my gallery. So if you want it, you can have it. You just have to look with custom content on. Um, it looks terrible because it's like winter, so everything's dead. Also, off camera, I cheated on you. I added a couple things in the backyard because I thought they were cute. Um, it's just like a tent in a slide. So please don't be too mad at me. Please don't, please don't be too mad. Um, I'm sorry for cheating on you. It won't happen again. <laughs> um, okay, let me introduce you to my Sims family. <laughs> Here we go. This is Everett. Now, Everett's in deep water because last night we were playing The Sims and my sim pedal who's our founder was about to go into labor and we got a call from him that was like i have a crush on someone else literally the night before i gave birth to our daughter and i'm just you know he has some karma in store i think like he's actually he he was intending he asked us if he could go out with someone else basically and I don't know, Petal is a nice person. She's trying to be forgiving. Also, I think Petal understands that her sons really love Everett because Everett and our son Aster are really close. So we're not going to murder him immediately. But if there is a cow plant accident in the future, like, you know, I don't know what happened. He just fell into the cow plant. That's all. Um... Anyways, so that's that's Petal and Everett. They they're supposed to get married, but we're holding off on the wedding because like I'm mad at him. I made him sleep in the pool. So, yeah. Uh this is Aster, our oldest son. He's super into frogs, dinosaurs, and outer space. Like he loves that's his thing. He loves that. Also, he's a kleptomaniac. So, he likes to steal things. Terrible. Um this is our uh, youngest son, Forrest. Forrest is just a soft little boy. Uh, he really likes animals, so we gave him this animal-themed uh, bedroom, which I think is so freaking cute. Again, this build is on the gallery, so you all can have it. And uh, this is our youngest daughter, Sage. Uh, she has a cloud-themed nursery, which we had a really fun time designing yesterday. Um, I love it. And she's wearing a cloud dress. Like, are you kidding me? That's so freaking cute. Um, also, I think Kyle Kyleson is still staying over. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Kyle Kyleson is in our guest room. And we were, like, thinking maybe we might have a little hee-hee-hoo-hoo with Kyle Kyleson behind Everett's back. But I'm trying to decide if Petal's that kind of person. Like, I feel like she would feel immense guilt. Like, she's a good person. So, I don't know. We might just, like, talk to Kyle Kyleson a little bit, though. Um, also thing on the list we need to do today is get pictures with sage as an infant okay and action let's play <laughs> wow so so those are our goals for today i really like this family in the house build you did thank you i'm obsessed with this family think about being nice to i love them so oh much God. which is faster hot or cold hot because you can catch a cold god damn it brie <laughs> I'm mad that your jokes are actually funny and I've never heard them before. Um, but isn't this nursery so freaking cute? Like, I love the cloud nursery. This is like my favorite room I've ever made, I think. Um, yeah, like an innocent flirt we could do. Is Kyle still here? Yeah, he's in the guest room downstairs. So she is self-soothing. So she likes to just kind of um, hang out. Try to go night-night. Please. This house is amazing, Shella. I love how the exterior looks. Thank you. I had a lot of fun building it. It's definitely a really good home for, like, a large family. Like, you could even fit, like, more than one sim in these bedrooms. And then we also have the downstairs bedroom, too. So, like, you could even make this office a bedroom. It would just be a weird shape. I don't know. It's just a good house. So, yeah, it's on the gallery if you all want it. What if Everett did the hee-hee-hoo-hoo with Kyle? I don't know. That would be an intense plot twist. We'll have to see. Does Kyle Carlson make cute babies asking for a sim? 
I have not made babies with Kyle Kyleson. Does anyone have answers? We we want answers. Yes, he does. Okay, chat seems to be confirming that Kyle Kyleson is supreme daddy dong water. That's good to know. That is, in fact, good to know. Odd head shape. Okay, okay, we can work with that. Um, I actually, Violet, I started doing rags to riches, but my Sims won the lottery. Petal literally won 1 million simoleons. So that is why my house is so nice, because I deleted all my lottery money. And because I think it's boring. But then when I went to build this house, I was like, I'm just going to build a house. I'm not going to give myself a budget because I basically have like a million simoleons that I deleted. So that's why. Otherwise, I wouldn't have a house this nice, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, I started with zero, zero simoleons. And now we're here. Shella, did you influence Kyle Kyleson's name? You know, I would like to think I did because I call myself Shella Shellerson the third. So I think perhaps maybe one of the sim gurus heard me call myself Shella Shellerson and they were like, that's it. That's the naming convention. That's what I like to think. Ew, that's my head cannon. All right. Have a good day at school, Aster. Also, Laura, thank you for the bits. Stunning house, beautiful family. Well done, Shella. You're so sweet. Oh my god. <gasps> they just passed each other. Kyle Kyleson. Okay, you have work to do. Why is my... Hold on a second. My uh, game volume is not coming through. I can't hear anything. I'm going to restart the game really quick. Sometimes I get this bug where like the audio for my game just isn't there. And the only way to fix it is restarting the game. One second. One moment, please. I subscribe to that headcanon. Thank you. <laughs> I recently introduced your videos to my sister and she's obsessed currently watching your YouTube videos. That makes me so freaking happy. You have no idea. Tell her thank you. Um, and thank you both for, for watching my YouTube videos. Uh, it's been really fun. I've been very grateful for the response to the new series that I've been posting. Um, I don't think I've ever gotten the amount of views that I've that I'm currently getting right now. And I understand that it's mostly because there's a lot of hype around The Sims right now. And usually people like watching episode one of Legacies, but I'm still really happy about it. It makes me really excited. And I, I get really pumped up to continue making videos uh, after reading comments and stuff that are like, this is awesome. And I'm like, oh my God, thank you. I My love language is words of affirmation. So that's why like Twitch is a good place for me because y'all can literally give me words of affirmation in real time. Um, it's really good. Um, no, don't skip work, Everett. No, 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 go to work. Why would he not go to work? Um, did I say response? Did I? I don't know if I meant to say that. Oh, Sage had her first laugh. Are you kidding me? Oh, that is so cute. She's just up here in her own steaming poo. That's not good. I'm going to have to feed her really quick. Um, I'm really sorry. The problem with Kyle Kyleson being here, by the way, is that my infant doesn't go to daycare. And Kyle Kyleson is home alone with my toddler and my infant. So it's a bit of a struggle. Um, thank you all so much. Thank you. You're so sweet. Um... When I looked on Twitter, I saw so many people thirsty for Kyle. I saw a lot of that too. But to be fair, I actually really do like Kyle. Be responsible, goblins. Is Kyle Kyleson in flaming boxers? Oh, do you want to see what he wore yesterday while taking care of my kids? I don't think you understand. Kyle Kyleson is an icon. Um... He was wearing a zebra speedo while babysitting while I was at work. Um, so, you know, you can expect Kyle Kyleson in a variety of outfits that are very flavorful. I'm upset. Oh my God, look at how freaking cute our daughter is. Okay. 
not me like side eye <laughs> kyle is in the room i was just gonna try to have this cute little moment of me and my daughter but like kyle kyleson's in the background are you kidding me kyle <laughs> we're home alone right now should i take the day off i might take the day off of work i'm gonna take a vacation day we can use this day to kind of get to know kyle a little better while our boyfriend's at work um, I'm gonna ex enthuse about botany to him. Um, time for woohoo with Kyle? No, I'm not gonna woohoo with Kyle, you guys. We can't be doing that. I also need to... Um, I also need to change Sage's diaper. She hates being held, though. Like, absolutely hates it. No, don't go to work. You're taking the day off. You're taking the day off. It's gonna be fine. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. Scratches for Olivia. Thank you. All right, let's change uh, Sage's diaper. Vacation day. You can always count on Kyle to walk in wearing something scandalous. <laughs> Make Kyle change the diaper? No, I'm not going to have him change my infant daughter's diaper. Look, I like Kyle, but that's that's a little personal. Um... Hello, I started watching you on YouTube the other day. Super cool that I caught a stream. Oh my gosh, welcome in! That's so fun! Welcome to the live. Um, if his partner gets cow planted, we go with Kyle. Yeah, we're, we're kind of... I don't know. I don't want to make you all any promises, is the thing. I think you all really want me to murder Everett, but I don't know if I want to yet. So, we're just going to see what happens. Uh-oh. Aster got sick and threw up in the hallway in front of a bunch of other students. Uh, do a health check. I'm sorry that he's throwing up at school. We're pro Everett in cow plants. The thing is, is that I don't, I don't know if I want this happy little family to, to be tragic. And like, also with the Sims in Bloom, I need to marry a Sim who likes the outdoors. I don't think Kyle Kyleson likes the outdoors, does he? Or do I just not remember? I think they can work it out. Yeah, he technically he didn't officially cheat on us. He just like kind of cheated on us. I'm just gonna flirt with Kyle just a little bit. Like just a tiny little bit. I'm just gonna be like, you look really good in that outfit. No, 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 go flirt with Kyle. Go do, go do a little, go do a little flirt. Hey, Kyle. You look good in that outfit. Oh my god, he's into it. I'm gonna discuss interest with him. Also, Jess, thank you so much for the resub for eight months. What was your old, um, username? And also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Scritches for Olivia. Thank you so much. I don't know. I don't know. Is it really a happy family? I don't know. Maybe he thought he was being funny. Sage is an intense infant. These infants have big emotions and are easily entertained. Uh-oh. Can I put Sage on the little tummy time mat? I would like to bring Sage downstairs so she can start working on, like, some milestones. That would be great. Also, if Everett's not alive, who else am I going to force to dumpster dive, chat? We got to think about that, too. Because right now we've been um, forcing Everett to dumpster dive for us. So, I don't know. You want me to put Kyle in the dumpster? Y'all just want drama, I think, is what you really want. You just want to break up this happy family. They're going to be okay. Also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Scritches for Olivia. Thank you. Let's do some tummy time. She's so stinking cute. I love Sage. Grab Milestone Unlocked. With all her might, Sage managed to pick up and grab onto something for the first time. Let's go. That's exciting. Okay, Forrest is looking for Kyle Kyleson. He wants Kyle to pick him up. Honestly, my boys love Kyle. So there's that. 
Trash belongs in the trash. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Oh, Olivia's kind of... She moves around a lot. Yeah, you can like kids radio music. That's fine. Okay, I want you to uh, do tummy time. Please. Tummy time. My Sims infant had her first word earlier and it was frog. I'm simply ecstatic. <gasps> Wait, they can have like an official first word. I haven't gotten to that yet. I don't know how to like make her talk. I guess talk to her maybe. How long am I planning on streaming? A couple hours as usual. She's also perfect opposite of her strict parenting. Yeah, that's true. She's really strict and Everett's more of a goofball. <gasps> Lift head milestone unlocked. Does that mean I can give you baby food? No, I need sit up milestone. Dang it. Okay, well, we can have you try to sit up. Give toy to Sage. I'll give her a little toy. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in, friends. Thank you. Yeah, I feel like maybe we'll have like a serious talk with Everett. Also, we did make him sleep in the pool. Like, it's not like we just forgave him right away. Um, however, I feel like he did go through a lot of effort to help our son build his treehouse. And like, Aster has a really good relationship with his dad right now. So I would feel kind of like really an evil person. Like, he loves Everett. He loves Everett. Also, not that this excuses it, but Everett does have the socially awkward traits. So what if, like, what if he was saying something awkward about, like, wanting, having a crush on someone? But I don't know. Maybe he, like, didn't know. <laughs> I don't think that's a, that's a good excuse, but maybe it was something. I don't know. We'll think about it. You should be able to practice sitting now. How do I do that? How do I, how do I practice sitting? Play with toys. I don't know how to practice sitting. Forrest is stinky. Yeah, you know, that kid is always stinky. That's unfortunate. She can't be in the mat. Oh. Okay. Let's see, let's see if we can have her practice sitting. Tummy time together. Uh, what option is it under? All I have is tummy time. She has to learn to roll over first. Oh, okay. So I guess we do need to do some more tummy time before then. Um, okay, Forrest, you're hungry. Let's open this up and get you some food. Grab a serving, my little dude. Um, okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like the new wheel is nice. I like the change, but, like, it's kind of confusing to me some of the times. I don't know if it's just me who feels that way, but... Um... Yeah, maybe. I don't know. He's just awkward. He's an awkward dude. Also, Kyle, can you stop, like, walking around in your flaming boxers? Like, <laughs> can you help out around the house a little bit, please? Okay, thank goodness. I think he's going to put that, put the dishes away. All right, our son's home from school. He's having a really bad day, so I might have him go do something fun. Maybe try going swings. Go swing with Kyle or something. Is Kyle Carlson a tribute to you? I, in my head, yes. But I haven't had it confirmed or denied yet. But I've decided that I think it's a tribute to me. So, you know. <laughs> um, okay, yeah, I'm going to try doing more tummy time. I thought I selected tummy time, but it doesn't seem to be going to tummy time. So I'm a little, she wants to put her in the crib. That's so weird. Did you see that? Like, I selected the mat, but she's like, I'm taking Sage to the crib. Like, she's just not listening to me. Oh, thank you, Nama Panda. Welcome. Enjoy your lurk work. Work lurk. 
Can I do tummy time here? I don't think so. I don't understand. Workaholic lifestyle. Maybe having too much free will. Yeah, it's like, it's a lot. They're not listening since the update. I feel like they're going to have to patch something, but I don't know exactly what they need to patch. Um, Comfort. What do you need? Oh, she's really tired, so I should probably like... Why are you getting her out of the crib again? Oh, I don't understand. You're having issues too? Yeah, I don't I don't know. It seems like everyone's having issues. This is so freaking precious. We're in our like <laughs> our work outfit though. Did I click pick up? Oh. Well, I did not mean to do that. They need to tune the autonomy care for infants a bit. It overpowers what you tell them to do. Yeah, that's what it seems to do. Okay, please read a story. I hope the story will help her learn how to talk a little bit. Yeah, also infant needs go down so quickly. Oh no, why are you nauseous? Do you need to go throw up? Uh-oh. He just got done swinging with Kyle Kyleson, so... I'm going to describe my imaginary friend. <laughs> Autonomy off doesn't seem to work anymore. Oh, does it not? Also, why is everyone in here? I'm trying to get my kid to go to sleep and everyone's like hanging out in here. This is not the spot for you all to hang out right now. No, thank you. Okay, I'm going to harvest my roses, by the way, and try to get more. Because uh, we need to get five perfect plants. Do y'all have any tips on how to get perfect plants faster? I'm assuming I probably need fertilizer. My older sims needs are going down way too fast. Like my sims got a full night's sleep. Went to work from 9 to 3 and was in the orange for sleep when I got home. Oh. Bees can pollinate plants. Would it work if I put a bee box in this uh, greenhouse or would that not work? Oh my god, you are not having fun at all. <laughs> at all. Also, I think it's Forrest's birthday tomorrow. Yeah. Fish fertilizer. Okay, I can get some fish. It should work. Okay. Okay, sell the snapdragons, harvest the roses. I want to plant more of the roses. Okay, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's go plant all of these. Also, I need my son to do his homework. Evie Delgado says, Hey, I've heard you became friends with Kyle Kyleson. He's pretty cool. All the kids love Kyle. I could get Apache or bunnies. I don't know if I want Patchy, though, because I want to get my gardening skill up myself. So I need to do all of the gardening. You know what I mean? I found that if I planted my plants in the ground and not in the boxes, they evolve so fast. Is that my problem? Because I do have fertile soil. If I, if I have boxes on the fertile soil a lot, does that prevent them from actually getting the fertile soil? Because that sounds kind of crazy. Uh, you just said your Sims won the lottery. How do you enter? Um, on lottery day, you just go to your phone and there's an option to enter the lottery. That's at least how I've been doing it. Also, I forgot to take pictures today with my daughter. Gosh darn it. 
once again, I can put the B box like, I don't know, I guess just in the middle. Hopefully that helps. They're sleeping. Okay, dang it. I should have remembered to, uh, why is there trash on my floor? I should have remembered to take pictures today. I'll have to do it tomorrow. Do I work tomorrow? I do, that's not good. Oh, but I think tomorrow's Winterfest, so maybe I won't have to go to work tomorrow. I'm hoping. What pack is the lottery? I think the lottery comes with seasons, right? Because it's a, it's a holiday. Hi! What is it? You want to tell chat something? You want to tell them? You want to tell them? Olivia has something to tell you all. <laughs> She's very serious about it. You want to tell them? Did you tell them what you wanted to? You want to sit on my lap? Is that what you want? There's no room on my lap right now. I'm playing The Sims. I'm playing The Sims, Olivia. Okay, did we do our homework? We could do extra credit homework. That's actually a good idea. Oh, Little Forest is watching TV. That's so freaking cute. Kyle, bring me drink. I'm actually afraid of Kyle bringing my son a drink. What if he brings him the the energy drink? I had Aster try one of his energy drinks, energy drinks yesterday, and it gave him an addicted to caffeine moodlet. So uh, just a warning. <laughs> just a little warning. If you want your kids to try energy drinks, it's not a good idea. Are there any fishing areas over here, by the way? I don't actually know. I don't think so. This is a new world, so I don't know, like, where any of this stuff is. What a sweet girl. Yeah, she's a baby. Say hi. I love your Sims name. Oh, thank you. Chat helped me name all of the kids and stuff. So thanks, chat. There's one close by. Okay, where? <laughs> On a dock? Is it on this thingy? I don't see one out here. On a dock. That dock I can't really get to. No. Where's the center by a lake? Oh, is it not in this neighborhood? Oh. Oh, way over here. Okay, that is actually pretty far. Um, that's like across the entire neighborhood, you guys. <laughs> Maybe I can teleport my sim out there, though. So that way she doesn't have to walk that far. But like, I'm way over here. That's good to know, though. Um, pedal. It is the middle of the night. Oh, shoot. I clicked the wrong button. I'm going to have her go fishing, though. Bree, thank you for the bits. What did the buffalo say to his son when he dropped him off at school? Bye, son. Oh my god. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hey, okay, we're gonna go fishing. Come on, pedal. Pedal. Why are you not teleporting? No, 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 no. Oh no, no. Oh, she's there. What the heck? That was weird. Leo, thank you for the bits as well. Thank you so much. Yeah, this neighborhood's pretty freaking big. I like that it's bigger, but I also think it's silly because it's mostly empty. So it's like, what's the point? You know what I mean? Also, I think I'm going to go into my settings really quick and turn off lifestyles. Because um, they're very annoying. That's how I feel. Olivia is looking majestic. Look at her. She looks really good. 
All right, let's let my kid out of the, the high chair. Everett, since when did you have back hair? I never gave you back hair. Girl. I swear, whenever you go into cast with your sims, after making them, sometimes it like assigns them random body hair. Do any of you have that issue? It's like so random. Yeah, she's staring me down because I won't let her sit in my lap. She's very upset. Hi. You want to sit with me? There's no room right now. There's no room. There's no room, baby. I got your cheek. I got your cheek. Good girl. <laughs> I had a very hairy grandpa. Yeah, it's like, I don't know why. It randomly assigns them body hair. Uh oh, my daughter is freaking out. <laughs> All right, Everett. Time to be a good dad. Let's bottle feed her. I've turned off enable hair growth. Like, I'm not even kidding you. I've set all of my settings when I made the sim, and it still goes back and changes things. Like, I'm aware of all the settings, so I, I change them. And then eventually I go back into cast to, like, give my kids a new outfit, and it's like, okay, I'm turning on all the body hair, all the hair growth. It even changed his default beard. And I was like, I don't want that. So I just don't know why it does that. It's so random. Okay, Petal's having a good time fishing. This is good. It's getting late, though. Like, our kids need to go to bed. Aster, you have school in the morning, kiddo. Actually, no, they don't. I keep forgetting that it's uh, Winterfest tomorrow. All right. Is she stinky? Well, change her diaper then. Come on, Everett. Yeah, I swear it turns itself back on. How am I feeling? I'm feeling really good. How are you? Dang it, Kyle. Kyle left one of his little juices in here. I'm not going to miss that when Kyle leaves. I'm going to be like, good riddance. I also added a couple families off the gallery from you guys into this world, so... I think I'm going to see if I can go meet them tomorrow. So that way my kids have some friends. Yeah, I don't want Kyle juice in my house. No, thank you. Can you do tummy time with her? Okay, my boys are asleep. Wow, you're really making her like... <laughs> Faceplant into this changing table. Poor kid. All right, let's fast forward a little. Hey, no such thing as late. Welcome on in. Roll over onto back milestone unlocked. Let's freaking go, dude. Do I still need to do tummy time to unlock like... Practice sitting. Oh, there it is. Get up here, Everett. Let's practice sitting. I want her to be able to sit up. That's so cute. She's doing it. Hi, Jules. How are you? Everett making Sage go under the changing table. I know. You can do it. There you go. All right. I'm bringing Petal home. I'm not going to make her walk all the way over here. Welcome home. How can I make a family visible for you to use? That's a good question. I um, have a hashtag called Shella Sims. Hashtag Shella Sims on the gallery. And that's where I go to look for any Sims that I want to download for like any of my Let's Plays. Uh, also, it's just a really good place to go in general if you're looking for Sims on for your own gameplay. Because there's so many incredibly talented people who post their Sims families to that hashtag. So feel free to use it on your own too. That's where I always look. And right now for this gameplay, I'm looking for Sims that have like kids of all ages. 
like infant, toddler, child, eventually teenager. Um, because a lot of my let's plays are kind of in the early stages right now. I'm like at the beginning of Plum Gen, the beginning of Sims and Bloom, the beginning of a hundred baby challenge. So like infants, toddlers, kids mostly. Um, but obviously I'll eventually have teens, so teens are okay too. Um, but th those are those are the kind of families I'm looking for right now. No, I don't think so, Caroline. And that's the weird thing to me because they gave us like this rug with so many swatches, but like my Sims never use it. So I'm like so confused about like why we even have the option of like so many different rugs if they're always using the plaid one. Does anyone else know if there's a way around that? Because to me, it just seems really silly. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, Olivia, I feel her staring at me. Like, she will not stop staring at me. All right, I want you to practice riding your bike today, buddy. Oh, can you not? Is it like... Let's try it again. Practice riding your bike. Are you looking for donors for your 100 infants challenge? Yes, I am looking for donors for my 100 infants challenge. So... Hi! Oh my god! Thank you! Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And thank you for the for the bits as well. You're very sweet. And I'm glad that you enjoy the content. Thank you so much. Enjoy your lurk, friend. Um, Just click on the rug. It's working for me. I guess I'll try again. Also, the fact that he has a ladybug helmet by default. Are you kidding me? Is my son not the cutest thing? What is Olivia doing? Oh, she's staring me down because I wouldn't let her sit on my lap with me. Yeah, this building's on the gallery. It is. <coughs> Sorry, I still have a bit of a cough. Is there a way to build walking paths or bike paths? Um, I'm not sure what you mean. Because you can only build on lots, so. But you could make like a, a lot themed for a bike if you wanted to, like a park maybe. The rugs don't work for me either. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. It makes me feel really dumb. But I love that he's practicing riding his bike. That's like literally the cutest thing. I'm so obsessed. Olivia's so cute when she sulks over lap time. She's like, mother, please. I would like to be on your lap. No, ma'am. Not right now. There's no room. There's no room. Big yawn. Big yawn. <laughs> Happy birthday to your dog. Also, hi, Miss Red Raccoon. How are you? All right, let's fast forward till the parents are awake. I want to go over and like meet some of the kids I put in the save file. Uh oh, Forrest is really hungry. All right, it's also his birthday today, which is kind of crazy. I cannot believe he's aging up already. She wants it so bad. <laughs> yeah, she really does. Level three of motor skill. Way to go. How are your skills coming, Forrest? I'm sorry. I haven't really been doing the best with you. Okay. They're not the worst, but they're not the best either. Our imagination is only level one. I feel a little bit bad for him. Okay, thanks. Can I make a club? I think I can add a couple people. Oh, yeah. Okay, the O'Brien family is a family that I added to my save file. And the Cartwright family. Oh, that feels awkward. Let me add these two and let me kick out Ronaldo. How do I kick him out? That sounds so mean. Um, maybe can I buy another club slot? No. Oh, God. Middle child syndrome. Yeah. I like your t-shirt. Oh, thanks. It's my friend's uh, uh merch collection. It says egglet on it. I love her merch. <sighs> okay, well, Timmy and Hallie 
are from the gallery. I don't know who made this family, but I added them to my save file, so. Maybe I can invite everyone over today. Uh, start gathering. If I open up the club settings, I can click on an X. Oh, there we go. Okay, I think Kelly is the other sim from the gallery that I added, so. Let's have them do fun activities. Let's do like... Is there a treehouse? Why is a treehouse not in outdoor kids activities? Would the treehouse count as playground equipment? Does anyone know? This house is definitely being my next family's home. Let's go. Do your homework. I wonder how many chat members have cats on them right now. That's a good question. If you're able to reply, do you have a cat on you right now? I don't see like the tree house. I wish that it was there. Hmm. No cat on me, but she's in the room. <laughs> that works. I guess I'll have swimming as an activity. Uh, I have a dog on my lap. I have a cat on me. Let's go. Oh, there's a pole. Do you have a cat on you? No, but I have a cat is my answer because I don't have my cat on me right now. <laughs> Let's hang out by the fire too. And then maybe just like social. Be friendly. There we go. Okay, hopefully all my friends come over today. It's my little brother's birthday, but I'm inviting my friends over. Also, that is so awkward. I kicked you out of the club. I'm sorry. You came over before I kicked you out of the club. So now you have to do the walk of shame. Ooh. Ah! No. Somebody clipped that. Something happened. I saw, I saw like a monster. This kid looked like a monster in the distance. Somebody needs to clip that. Am I the only one that saw it? It looked like a spaghetti man. <laughs> that was scary. Oh my God, it's doing it, it's doing it. Ah, why, why? Oh my God, he looks like a spaghetti man. Oh my god, but it's only from a distance. From a distance. <laughs> what is that? Oh my god, I am terrified. Olivia, this is not a drill. We're being haunted. <gasps> it's only if I'm far enough away from him. Okay, um, who made this family? The O'Brien family. <laughs> Your kid is cursed. Is that one of the kids? So this is a new kid's shirt. Is that what it is, Larian? Maybe that's what it is. An LOD glitch. That is kind of funny. I like it. It's cursed. Okay, oh, Sage is up. Can we uh, go grab Sage? Hi, baby. Hello. Hi, sweet girl. You really want to sit on my lap so bad right now? Did you hear her? I think I'm going to let her. I feel bad. <laughs> okay, come here. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Come on. She jumped to the ground. If 
If that's not the most cat thing ever. Baby, what do you want? You want to go outside? Hey. Hold on. You want to go outside? Is that what you want? What is it? What do you want? Are you hungry? Hold on, she wants food. Are you dying of hunger? Are you dying? Okay, sorry. I don't know if you could hear her, but she was really meowing. She just wanted food. Okay. Um, also, unknown entity, thank you for the Risa for 10 months. Thank you so much. She's obviously dying, in case you didn't know. Okay, I want to do practice sitting. What's the name of the infant? Oh, this is Sage. This is Sage. No, practice sitting. What are you doing? Come on, pedal. You could hear her? Okay. <laughs> She's clearly, literally dying as we speak. Okay, go grab some food, Everett. Is it bad that I don't really want to celebrate Winterfest? I'm like, been there, done that. I don't really care. Also, are you doing okay? I'm going to have you get off your bicycle. Oh my god, it's happening. You guys, this is so cursed. <laughs> okay. Anyways, roll over onto tummy milestone unlocked. Let's go. Did you just leave her there alone? No, go practice sitting. Sage has gained the ability to roll over onto her tummy. Now she'll be able to start tummy time on her own. Oh, well, that's exciting. Spider kid. Yeah, I'm I'm a little scared of him. Also, only if my, two of my friends came over, I think. So I'm a little sad about that. Okay, here's Forest. Here we go. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. No, I want you to go upstairs and do tummy time. Or no, do uh, practice sitting with Sage. Come on, please. Please pedal for the 15th time. Why is she not going? Why? Why? Why won't she do it? Is Kyle being helpful? Yeah, I set him to help out around the house. So he is being helpful. Oh, I want to get a picture. I need to get pictures with her today, too. That is so cute. Are you kidding me? Should I should I try to do it? But the background's so ugly. I guess I should try. We'll do it after we try to uh, help with tummy time. Maybe I can get a picture of her downstairs trying to help us sit up. I think that'd be really cute. When moms go rogue, I reset them. No, that's smart. That's really smart. Olivia. Oh my God, I think she has to poop now. <gasps> Milestone. What's happening? Wait, is she free? Sage is free. She learned how to sit up. Let's go. Oh my God, that's so freaking cute. Are you kidding me? Oh my God, look at this little guy. She's sitting. We did it, chat. We did it. Okay, that's good. We can get some good pictures with her then. 
All right, I'm going to go to the bathroom and then we'll go see if we can um, have Everett take some good pictures of us. She's free! <laughs> Sage right now, Rish sit. I love that. I love that for us. Um, excuse me. Not my son learning how to ride a bike through the walls of my house? Buddy, I don't think that's how bike riding is supposed to work. Hello? Can I help you? Not Kyle and... Kyle is teaching him how to ride a bike in the house. Kyle is encouraging it. I can't believe this. Oh. Oh my god. No, this is out of line. This is out of line. <laughs> what a typical Kyle move. I know, right? Get off your bike. I'm putting it back outside. Oh my freaking god. I cannot believe this. <sighs> yeah, she can try her first food. That's really exciting. Um. Okay, I want to go outside with Sage. So I'm going to teleport my sim here and teleport you here. And then Everett is going to be the one taking the picture. So I'm going to have him go potty really fast. Okay, where's Sage? Okay, there she is. So I'm thinking I'm going to change Sage's outfit into her cute little cloud dress. And then I feel like we could just wear this blue one or maybe we should see if we have an outfit that will stand out a little better. Hmm. I don't know. We could go with this outfit. That one's cute. Only with Kyle would this happen. Yeah, I'm telling you. Kyle is scary. Okay, how do I how do I help you do anything? Actions. Baby care. Can I like I was kind of hoping I could get a picture of us, like, helping her. Maybe we can give her a kiss. Okay, I'm going to need Everett out here, stat. Get off the toilet. No, where are you going? Also, why is she back in this outfit? No. Change outfit. Come here. Excuse me? What is going on? We're suddenly upstairs with Sage. <sighs> hold on, you guys. This is going to be really tedious for us, okay? I'm going to need everyone to hold their breath. Because this is going to be so freaking tedious. Okay, we can do this. We're all in this together. Okay, come here, Everett. No, come here. Go here. No, where are you going? Do not go put down Sage. I want to take a picture of you. No! Oh my god. Pick up. Okay, come here. <laughs> this is gonna be so freaking annoying. You wanna sit on my lap? Okay, she's on my lap now. I'm not only trying to wrangle my Sims, I'm trying to wrangle my infants and my cat. I'm just a wrangler today. That is my job. Yeah, the way they just leave their infants on the floor is really funny. I, I do agree with you there. Okay. I would like you to then, can we, can we give her a kiss? I feel like that would be really cute. Take photo. 
Take the freaking photo, Everett. That would be such a cute photo right now if you were taking it. I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm gonna lose my mind. Okay, we're gonna try that again. We're going to... We're going to give you a kiss. This is how to take photos without any photo mods. It's a nightmare. Yes, yes! <gasps> Was it worth it? It was worth it. That is such a cute photo. Like, are you kidding me? That is literally so precious. Deep breaths, everyone. This brings me so much joy. Okay. Okay, pause. Now, what if we... What if we now practice standing right there? Okay, take photo. Get out of the way, Aster! Two years. Okay, that's still cute. That's still adorable. <gasps> Jules, thank you for the 24 month, two year resub. I really appreciate it. Welcome back! Oh my gosh, enjoy your galaxy badge. Let's freaking go. How freaking exciting. Thank you so much. I hope you're having a good day today. Honestly, I hope everyone's having a good day today. Better than me. As I'm struggling here to take pictures of my Sims. <coughs> She's getting her Simba moment, yeah. I think that these are good, like, good pictures though, don't you think, chat? I feel like they're good ones. How do you rotate the picture so well? Uh, if you have the tripod, you get this uh, ability down here to rotate it. And it kind of helps you get a good angle if you have a certain angle in mind. Also, Mars Bar, thank you for the first time sub. Chat, you know what that means. Enjoy your emotes and ad free viewing. But most importantly, enjoy your new smile. Smile with us. I just got back. I finally have my service dog back. That's awesome, Alex. I'm really happy for you. That is awesome. I feel like this is a good photo angle too. She looks so freaking cute. Very good chat. Very good. Okay. We did it. I think that's enough. Also, she's stinky now, so it's fine. I think we got enough pictures of uh, Petal and, and Sage. <sighs> wow. That was one of the most stressful things I've ever done. Oh, did you just pee on me? F this face, she's like, Dear God, my child is so smelly. This would be a good thumbnail. I'll take that picture. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, sorry. I know I wasn't looking at chat very much, but I, I hope you understand. I had a mission. And I had to complete the mission today before the sun went down. Are my cursed friends still over? They are. Okay, that's good. I wonder if any of them will come play pretend with me. Let's play Fairy Tale Castle with my friends. You ended the photo shoot just right. Yeah, honestly, just in time we ended the photo shoot. Are we gonna go give her a bath or are we putting her on the floor while we take a bath? Give Sage a bubble bath. Girl, she's stinky. She just peed all over us. Also, I don't know if I got a milestone from that, but it does look like 
uh she's fascinated with us and we have a whole heart for her stage look at her just scooting around is that how they move i haven't had an infant that can scoot yet is that how they move before you teach them how to crawl yeah today is forest birthday today is forest birthday you're getting a, a bath in a bougie tub by the way kiddo cuteness overload that's so freaking cute I don't know where my friend is. I invited him to come play pretend with me, but he's not here. Um, okay, go potty, buddy. I think we have a birthday cake, but I'm going to double check. It is getting towards the end of the day, so we should probably think about having the birthday here pretty soon. What did you say? Cuteness overload. Also, Father Winter's coming tonight, so I'm hoping Aster and Forrest will be up late enough to ask Father Winter for a gift. Oh, hi, Everett, sweetie. Is there something I can do for you? Oh, I don't think so. Oh, you finally put on clothes. Let's go. He's pretending to play pretend. Oh my gosh, he's like ahead of the game. I'm going to play symbols with Kyle Kyleson. All right, and then Petal, you deserve a bath as well after this. So we're going to give you a bath after Sage takes a bath. Hi, Kay. Welcome in. You can make the cake. Yeah, we already have the cake made, so we're we're good on that end. First bubble bath milestone. Oh, is this the first time I've bathed my daughter? Oh. She hates being held. Free air tinkler. Wow. Look at all of our milestones. That's so fun. Hi, loving the new LP. I'm not cut up so watching on YouTube. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad you're loving it. Thanks, Temperamental. Yeah, I'm definitely ahead on Twitch. Um, so I totally understand. Can we try to go to sleep? I would like to try to go night-night, please. She's a self suver so hopefully she can go night-night. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no, there's only room for one K in this chat. <laughs> we have a lot of Ks in the chat, I I'll be honest with you. Even one of my mods is a K, so... Um... The little angry lip. Oh, she's sleeping on her tummy. Is that because she knows how to roll over now? I bet it is. Uh oh, did this break again? This freaking thing? I'm gonna replace it. All right, Forrest, we're gonna come age you up. Are you ready, little buddy? Are y'all ready to see child Forrest? Oh my gosh. It feels like that went by really fast, to be honest with you. That went by really fast. I'm the only sauce version of the Malas. I don't know how many Rachels are in the chat, but those are my favorite. For no reason in particular. Who's at my door? Is that Clara Bjergsen? Can I help you? Please leave. Wow, I'm finally a favorite. Wow. By default. <laughs> Why are you not eating your food? Forrest, where are you? Hi, little buddy. Are you ready to age up? I'm going to help him blow out his candles. Uh, help blow out candles, Forrest. Humble Borpna. I'm your favorite. Yeah, if your name's Rachel, you're my favorite. That's how it works around these parts. Are you ready to grow up, little guy? I'm going to miss his toddler bedroom. It's really cute. Can you ask for help blowing out the candles? I don't know why Petal's not helping me. Oh, there we go. Oh, man. I'm going to miss little baby Forrest, you guys. He looks so much like his mom. Like, that's crazy. They also have, like, the same color palette. Look at 
Look at his goofy little face. Look at this little goober. Humble Borp, nah. <laughs> He's a carbon copy of his mom. He really is. I guess when he ages up, we'll be able to see a, a bit more of his features to see if he has like any of his dad's features. But he definitely got a lot of his mom's features. All right. Ooh, we get to randomize our trait. Let's see. Actually, I'm going to do multi-skill. Give me a random number between one and four. Two. Creative genius. The Sim wants to build their creative and mental skills to inspire innovation and play. I feel like that makes a lot of sense because growing up, he had no creativity. So maybe he's going to try to work on it now. Absolutely no melanin in that little man. Negative. Not here. Uh, yeah, it's the new it's new child trait that you can get, so that's fun. Um, but yeah. Okay, chat. Which trait are you manifesting for Forest? Humble Borfna. Kitty needs noms. Oh, don't worry. She just ate. She's good. She just had some food. Why are y'all manifesting terrible traits for him? Evil, klepto, mean, loner? Doesn't our little boy deserve better? Oh, adventurous. These sims seek out new and unique experiences. Okay. Well, there we go. Forrest is now aged up. Does anyone else age up soon? Oh my God, on Friday, our little baby Sage ages up. That's gonna be so sad. That's our last infant of this generation. I like that for him. Yeah, I think it's really good. All right. Here you are, little man. I definitely liked you with longer hair um, a lot better. So there's that. Also, I think he got um, the gap tooth again. Are teeth genetic now? Because I feel like Aster also got the gap teeth. And... Petal has the gap teeth. So is that... Oh no, Petal does not have the gap teeth. Wait, how did they get it? Do you have the gap teeth, Everett? No. Wow, I don't know how they got him. He is 100% a copy of his mom. Yeah, for sure. I feel like he definitely got his mom's eye shape because we can see over here, Aster has his dad's eye shape. And his mom's eye color. But Forrest has his dad's eye color and his mom's eye shape. So, yeah. That's cool. I don't know if it's a childhood thing. I think, I think it's cool, though. Okay, well, I'm not really digging the haircut you have. So, maybe we go for something longer again. Were there any new hairs that came with this pack for kids? What if we use this one? This is one of the new hairs. <laughs> I think it randomizes. I had one twin get gap teeth and one twin as not. Oh, that's cool. I feel like <coughs> I feel like before the teeth didn't really randomize that much. You think he's Draco Malfoy? Draco. Draco Malfoy. No, I, I can see that. I like that. I think that's good for us. I think that's fun. I like it. Okay, let's do... Um... Oh, yeah, there's also some new skin details that I wanted to try, too. Dang, he looks beautiful. What if we had some freckles? Because our mom has freckles. So it makes sense that we would have freckles too. I might actually change her freckles. No, I'll keep them the same. But I think it makes sense if he if he had some freckles. Keep him super pale. Well, yeah, I'm not going to change his like skin color. We're going to keep that however it comes out. 
Maybe some freckles on the shoulders, too. He's so cute. Horse is adorable. I cannot. I know. I love him. Okay, let's check out some of the new clothes then. Let's see what we got. Oh my god. He's a little adventurous guy. He also really likes animals. So if any of these have animals on them... Yeah. That is... 100% your vibe, my dude. Yeah. I think that's that's his energy. Look at how freaking cute he is. Like, are you kidding me? I have freckles, but only on one side of my face. Really? I don't know if I have ever seen that. That sounds so unique and fun. Okay, no shoes. All right. My okay, Ben. I guess I'll just use these shoes. I think that's fine. Look at how cute he is. I know. I really like the vibe of the clothes from this pack, too. I think they're very nice. I don't think you need a bracelet or anything. Maybe we can get... We can have them make friendship bracelets now. Him and his brother. That will be so nice. Also, I need to add Sage's pronouns. I didn't do that last time. <laughs> okay. I think this fits his vibe perfectly. Yeah, he has a very, like, pale vibe going on. And his brother is super cute, too. I like this kid a lot. Look at him. I think the freckles look so cute on him as well. Okay, let's do our formal outfit. Is there anything with the new pack? Doesn't look like it. Does not look like it. Um, I'll just go to styled looks. And just give him an outfit. I don't really care. When are we ever going to see him in his formal outfit? If we do a wedding, I'll like... Customize their outfits, you know? Okay, this is our uh, athletic wear. So I think I like this one because it has an elephant on it. I think that's so cute. He's literally adorable, I know. I can't get over this kid. <laughs> Look at how strong and cute he is. His pail is so cute, right? You think Force gives they them vibes? Honestly, I could get behind that. Do you think we should maybe have him like experimenting a little at this age? And then uh, whenever he ages up full, I kind of like that. Let's do custom pronouns. They or them. Okay, he, they pronouns. Let's do it. I like the giraffe onesie because um, he likes animals a lot. So it makes sense to me. Yeah, I, I like them. Okay, party outfit. Oh, <gasps> oh my God, this looks so soft and cute. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Sorry about my cough, you guys. Uh, also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Scritch is for Olivia. Thank you. Is the next generation a vet? See, I haven't even looked at the next generation yet. I kind of like being a little surprised. But we'll definitely have to decide. I love them. I love them too. Definitely, like, soft vibes. Like, this kid is sensitive. Very sensitive. Very much like, guys, let's not fight. I don't like it when we fight. Super cute. I know, I love him. 
I like the freckles on his shoulders too. Okay, interesting. Oh no. I was gonna say that's an interesting color. Okay, this is our summer outfit. <clears throat> um, maybe this like bird, bird shirt. Why is that me? Are you forest? Or is forest you? Oh slash if you identify with forest. I think they give off really soft vibes. Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Also, I just want to comment on how this uh, kids kit shoes like match a lot of the outfits. I feel like that was intentional from them. Oh, slash. Yeah, this is the strictly parented child. For some reason, both of his parents have a very strict relationship with with them so in a way i feel bad but maybe it's helped them turn out for the better almost i kind of like the blue i don't know though i feel like they have very light light energy very light energy Maybe something like that. Hi, welcome in. I know how you usually prefer to play with Fem Sims. Are you planning on Sage being the heir? I always have a preference for Fem Sims, but um, I think I will probably go with what makes the most sense. Cause like, I do like when you all have the ability to vote on what happens. Um, the thing is that's gonna be a little bit weird is that our heir does have to have traits like very specific traits so if we decide on one of them being the heir after we already have their traits we're gonna have to switch them um which i dislike but you know that's just how it's gonna have to go i guess um but it'll be fine i'll just go with whichever person makes the most sense i think Um, oh my gosh, Megs, I'm sorry that you're dealing with that today. Sending you all the love, my friend. Maybe. I grew up in Texas, so I feel like my uh, lack of cold weather outfits really shows. Like, this is what you would wear in Texas on a winter day. Um, but I feel like if someone grew up in, like, Canada or something, they might be like, I need a snowsuit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh my gosh, I love all of their outfits. This kid is so stinking cute. Wow, I can't wait to see what they look like when they grow up. That's what you would wear inside on a winter day. Like this outfit in particular, something about this is just really cute. Like I'm, I'm obsessed with this outfit. I honestly feel like maybe we should give Aster some updated outfits, but... I might just wait until Aster's a teenager. Cause like, what's the point right now? You know? I feel like that's fine. Hi, welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Scritch is for Olivia. Thank you. Pronouns for Forest. Okay, yeah, so I'll go over all my Sims pronouns just in case you're new here. So we have Everett, he, him, uh, Petal, she, her, uh, Aster, he, him. Forest, he, they. And Sage, she, her. We are thinking Forest might go full they, them as they age up, though. So we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and upload this version of my family to the gallery as well, just in case you all enjoy playing with my Sims. Uh, and then you can have a uh, child Forest in your save file so that could be fun i i'm like literally so obsessed with this family like you have no idea like i love them so much i feel like together they made the cutest little babies like are you kidding me okay also i was wondering how forest was paler than his mother because petal is pale right but like, 
even petal has a bit more color under her skin and i realized it's because um forest's dad has a neutral skin tone and forest mom has a warm skin tone so um he got a neutral whitest skin tone which made it so there was like no red in his skin at all which i thought was interesting um it's because his dad has a neutral skin tone so he's super white <laughs> he's like a napkin <laughs> it's kind of cool how like the genetics like mix like that um yes this game is really fun is he albino i don't think so i don't think albino is in the game um but this kid's just really pasty so it is fascinating it is they're super pale i like it i like it too okay we have to give forest uh their child bedroom now so let's go into build mode um i'm going to miss this little this cute little um this cute little toddler bedroom like oh my god i'm gonna miss it so much i want to keep a lot of the same vibes though except obviously we don't need a changing table in here we don't need the toddler bed or the toddler blocks but i'm honestly kind of hoping maybe we can just put a bed right here and get a dresser or something over there i don't know the sun's gonna love them. Yeah, the sun's gonna be like, om nom nom nom. But I feel like a bed right here still fits the room because of this bookshelf. Yeah, maybe they just don't tan. I also don't tan. So I I relate. Hmm. Okay, the cloud bed having this ugly red wood makes me very upset. Um, I feel like maybe this bed kind of matches the best. The green one, if we want to use one of the new beds. And I don't think I'm going to give them a... Uh, I don't think I'm going to give them a bunk bed. I think maybe I put a desk over here, though. I just glow. <laughs> yeah, I just reflect the sunlight. <laughs> That's me. Um, give them a desk over here. What is happening? It's trying to like slot into that bunk bed. That's really annoying. But I feel like a desk here. is cute uh thanks for the follow by the way welcome in scritches for olivia thank you we got our green chair and then uh a dresser not sure if i like that one i feel like maybe this dresser will work perfectly in this space Ooh, we got some greens in there. That's kind of nice. I like that. And then I never have my Sims actually use the dresser, so I just put items in front of it. It's whatever. Um, But yeah, I think that this, all of this stuff still kind of works in the bedroom. Is there any other items? Oh my god, a microscope? Let me sell that. My dad dumpster dove for this doll, so I'm going to use this doll. I have a little debug doll or something. Just right there. <laughs> um, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you so much. Okay. I have a little plants. Do I want a plant in this room? It does kind of match the vibes. I don't know, though. Are we old enough to have a plant in our bedroom? I mean, I guess our curtains are plants. I 
I think that's cute. Maybe size down and on the desk. I think we can definitely put a plant on the desk. These are the dirty dishes I stole from school. I will put those away. <laughs> Which backpack? Oh my god, do you think we would have the cow plant backpack? Because we're into animals and also we have a cow plant in the front yard. I think that's so cute. You're never too young to be a plant parent. There we go. Uh, okay, anything else that I want to add in here? I think like some crafts would be kind of fun. Um, maybe this little thing over here as well. Because it's animal themed. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Yeah, the cow plant backpack. Isn't it so cute? I'm obsessed with it. I like it a lot. How am I? I'm doing great today. How are y'all doing? Do I want forest room to be messy? No, I won't do that to him. What else? What else? What else? Um. Hmm. I was thinking like maybe I could like alt place some books up here. I think that's good enough. I'll just put these by the dumpster. There we go. Yeah, I feel like Forest would have a pretty clean room. I agree with that. Maybe we can do some uh, fairy light vibes in here. Because they're getting older. Ooh. What if... I feel like that maybe is a little bit too protruding. Hmm. Where are the fairy lights? Whoa. String of stars. Hold on. Did they add this to the game? And I haven't seen it yet? <gasps> Hold on a moment. That is so cute. I need these for my other kid's bedroom too. <laughs> Those are so fun. I didn't realize that they came with the infant update. That's really exciting. Oh my gosh, I love getting new lights like that. That's that's fun. Okay, do we have a new, uh, do we have a lamp I could have on my desk? This one is plant related. I want it to be like right there. Perfect. Uh, and then we need an overhead light. For sure. Hi, little Dika. This room has amazing vibes. Thank you. This is our um, middle child's room. They really like animals. I think this leafy light is perfect for that bedroom. Okay. Thoughts? I think that's nice. I quite like that. Maybe I can get something on the wall over here, too. Oh, thanks, Kefe. You're so sweet. What the heck? I really appreciate it. Sometimes y'all be too nice to me. What if we did like the orangutan reading there? That's kind of fun. I like that. It's forest theme because my kid's name is Forest. Nice. Okay. Cool. Perfect. I'm going to get rid of this, though. <laughs> I don't like that plant in the corner. I don't like it. It was not the vibes. Your grandpa's name is Forest? No way. I love the orangutan. Very cute. All right, well, 
Maybe a picture of a forest. This is a werewolf poster, but we can pretend. Okay. I think that's good enough for now. This overhead light is from Eco Lifestyle. Eco Lifestyle. Okay. There we go. Okay, forest, your bedroom, your new bedroom is up here. There we go. Okay, they can get their own food now. What pack is the green plushie from? I actually don't know off the top of my head. Um, it might be from like kids stuff or toddler stuff. I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know off the top of my head. Oh my God. I didn't realize Father Winter's here. Hold on a moment. Aster, wake up. We gotta go say hi to Father Winter. Kid stuff? Okay, gotcha. Oh my god, are you... Did you just walk in on my boyfriend in the bathtub? Yeah, I'd be embarrassed if I was you too, Clement. That is really embarrassing. Why are you even in my bedroom? And he's laughing too. Yeah, that's weird. Can you give me a present? And he barely laughed about it. Is Kyle still there? Yeah, I think Kyle's still here. Maybe Father Winter wants to steal my man. Do you think so? It could be possible. Okay, let's both ask Father Winter for a present. Come on, Father Winter, please. <gasps> oh my gosh. Sinanen, thank you so much for continuing that gift sub you got. That's so sweet of you. I appreciate it. Welcome back. Hello. Where are you giving that to? <laughs> I'm over here. Not this. Okay, you need to go to bed. Uh, Lissa, thank you for the 30-month resub, by the way. Welcome back. I appreciate it. Boris got a train set. Interesting. Thank you. Can the infant interact with him? Uh, she can, like, smile and coo at him, but that's it. <gasps> Whoa, Aster got a wisp? Are you serious? Oh, it's, it's a card. Never mind. I got really excited. It's just that. Okay. Well, I'm going to bed. Good night. Good night, Father Winter. I gotta check on the train set that I got. I'll put this in here for when Sage ages up. Do you guys like my cloud nursery, by the way? It's cloud themed. And she wears a cloud dress. It all comes together. Maybe he wants to be a stepfather. I am not bringing Father Winter into my family, you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh, no way! You're on episode 56 of my career legacy challenge. Oh, well, thank you. I really, really appreciate it. And I hope you enjoy continuing the binge. Um, So cute and cozy. Thank you. Does the holiday matter for the infant? No, not at all. Sage ignores all the tradition. That makes sense to me. It'd be really weird if she cared about getting a present or not. Because <laughs> she's just a, just a little baby. Okay, do I have the, enough energy to go take care of my plants today? We really need to start working on getting our garden better. He killed my sister, Rose, in the career legacy. He did. Yeah. So my retired mom just sent me an emoji for the first time. I don't know how to react. She's trying her best. <laughs> Gardening level eight. Let's go. Babies live minute by minute. Exactly. Whoa, who's embarrassed? Oh, Astra's going through a nasty phase. No, you're going to have a mean streak, but you're my angel baby boy. You can't be mean. That's not allowed. <laughs> also, y'all need to stop, like, 
bothering him. He's trying to sleep. Did you ask Father Winter for a present? Did he leave? Oh my god. It's too late for me to get a present from Father Winter. Dang it. He's my angel baby boy. Our daughter also ages up on on Friday. That's our last infant for this generation, you guys. I'm not having another baby. I think three is enough. Whoa, are we talking to Kyle? Did he just flirt with us? They're going into the bathroom. Oh! They're going into the bathroom. Oh my god! Oh my god, no! Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Whoa! My boyfriend's literally right there on the couch! Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the biggest scandal! I can't believe this. On Winterfest? You're gonna woohoo with Kyle Kyleson right in front of your boyfriend? Oh my god. I do have risky woohoo on. There's no way. There's literally no way. No way. Okay. Oh my god, the, the the drama, the suspense. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Lauren. Lauren. I you guys just Listen. I literally my sim autonomously woohooed with Kyle Kyleson. Like, they don't have any romance at all. Kyle's just staying over. And Kyle was like, ooh. And then they went and woohooed in the bathroom right in front of my boyfriend. Like, in this bathroom. Just, like, seconds before you raided. And I had risky woohoo on, so I was so scared we'd get pregnant. But we didn't. I'm just, I'm at a loss. Did somebody clip that? Because that was literally so iconic. Like, oh, there's so much scandal happening right now. I'm overwhelmed. Holy cannoli, you guys. Oh my gosh. Thank you for the raid, by the way. <laughs> Perfect time for a raid. There's so much drama going on. If you're new here, my name's Shella, and I'm playing The Sims in Bloom Legacy. And this is my first generation. And oh my god, the tea is piping hot, you guys. Like, I cannot believe Petal just agreed to woohoo with Kyle. And now they're just... Kyle. And now they're just like acting like nothing happened between them? She's just gonna go to bed? Oh my god. Also, thank you for the follow, uh, Br Brisky. Welcome on in. Some scritches for Olivia. Why are you sleeping on the couch? Oh my god. I have never been so shocked and appalled in my life. There's Is there drama happening in your game too? Just autonomous drama. It's so juicy. It's so good. Try to go night night. Please. I'm losing it. No! No, we can't woohoo with Kyle for funsy. I have risky woohoo on and I don't want another baby. Thank you for the resub, though, Star Daisy. And also, Caffeine Queen and Storm, thanks for the follow. Scratches for Olivia. Welcome in. Oh my god, you guys. I cannot wait to upload this to YouTube. They're gonna love it. <laughs> yeah, so if you missed it, Petal woohooed with Kyle Kyleson out of nowhere. I didn't tell her to woohoo at all in front of her boyfriend. On Winterfest. And I don't think Everett knows. Like, he didn't see it at all. He was sleeping. 
I'm planning for my sim sister to get pregnant accidentally and then not realize until it's too late and then give the baby up for adoption to her brother for Gen 2 of Whimsy. <gasps> but not as spicy as yours. No, that's that's some drama. Also, Sage put her toe in her mouth. You're so cute, Sage. Can you please, can you go to sleep? Can you try to go night-night? Oh my god. I can't right now. Get fed by Kyle then. Kyle, come do some work. I cannot. <laughs> <coughs> also, um, if you all don't already follow my friend Lauren, please make sure to do so. Because if you like spicy drama, let me tell you, Lauren knows how to cook it up. It's crazy. This is so juicy. Kyle! Help! Feed me! I think he leaves tomorrow. Yeah, literally, this is his last day here. He had to woohoo us before he left. Maybe he fell in love with us. Kyle, I'm hungry. Okay. I think I found Kyle Kyleson's only like non-fan. And it's my toddler, it's my infant. That she wants to kill him. Everyone else loves Kyle, and Sage is like, I literally will eliminate this man on site. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Wait, when did you change your Twitch name? What did you change about it? It looks the same to me. What? Am I dumb? Sage knows what he did. Yeah, Sage is like, I can't believe you did this to mommy. Kyle is daddy? Yeah, I've heard that he makes good baby. Oh, oh, okay. I got you. Well, I love the I love the little rebrand. <laughs> also, Sharky, thank you for the follows. Scratches for Olivia. Welcome in. Imagine Kyle Woohoo's with Everett next. I don't know, man. Hide your kids, hide your wife. Kyle Kyleson is out here. Okay, can you go to sleep? Go night night. Go night night. She's a self suver so there we go. Oh, she rolls all over the place now. That's so freaking cute. Are you kidding me? Also, Calm Clam with the scritches for Olivia. Thank you. I changed mine recently and nobody recognizes me anymore. The thing is, is that sometimes people change their names on Twitch and I'm like, literally, who are you? Because their name is nothing like their old username. So if that, if you all ever change your username, you have to tell me. I will not know. I will literally not know who you are. You'll be like, hello, I'm a two-year resub. And I'll be like, who are you? <laughs> Where did you come from? Um. Also, thank you for the follows. Welcome in, friends. Thank you so much. There we go. Perfect. Oh, my God. Oh, hey, Kyle. You're still hanging out? Good. Everett literally has no idea what happened should i be more lenient everett is wondering whether the strict rules and high standards oh my god stop strict rules and high standards are worth upholding for his usually well-behaved family member perhaps he should loosen his expectations a bit yeah honestly you shouldn't be so strict with forest forest is a really good child like they have never misbehaved ever you should be nicer to them uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. How do I look at your houses in the gallery? Um, I will say a lot of my houses have custom content in them because I use a photo mod. So you probably have to filter with custom content on if you can't see them. But that's the only custom content I use. I just have like photos like this one right here. This is a family portrait mod. Oh, which by the way. Dang it, I should have. Uh, locked the portrait before this but there we go we have another family photo look at how cute this family is i love them so much also if you want to catch up on this legacy tea i upload all of these videos over on my youtube channel so feel free to feel free to check them out it's a good time to join because we're in the beginning of the challenge so you're not even that far behind 
Am I going to go cry in bed? No, we don't have time for that. We do not have time to go cry in bed. Also, Forrest, you're late to school, buddy. It's your first day of school and you're late. You can't be, you can't be late like that. Go on now. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Do I have a Discord? I do. Yeah, links in the chat. Thanks, Kiki. You're planning on watching the VODs after this? Perfect. Perfect. Even though I'm here live, I watch them on YouTube as something to watch in the background. Oh, that means a lot to me. Because, yeah, I do get uh, ad revenue if you watch my YouTube videos. And it really adds up. Haha, <laughs> get it? Ha 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 ha. I'm sorry. Oh, my cow plan is alive. Mufasa. Okay, I might move Mufasa to the backyard and keep Mushu there. But I was thinking about moving like Mufasa to like here, maybe. Yeah, I like that. Do you get paid if I have YouTube premium or whatever it's called now? Honestly, I don't know. I'm really dumb when it comes to YouTube questions. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know. Everett has been invited to give a talk at the local school on wildlife and conservation. The teacher asked for it to be as exciting and informational. Informational. Informative. As possible, as it just so happens, Everett has been fostering an endangered plant in the pot for the last few days. It might be a risky move to plant, but the kids would love it. Ooh, what should I do? Yes, we do get paid for YouTube premium ad revenue. Oh, thank you, Lauren. Yeah, Lauren is really smart <laughs> when it comes to YouTube stuff. I'm like, I literally have no idea. So that's good to know. Informational didn't sound right. Yeah, it's like informative. I think he would take the, the plant to class because he has kids and he's probably like, yeah, the kids would love this. Performance gained large. The kids in class were enthralled with the real life endangered plant. They all loved it and pledged to protect the environment. Oh, well, there you go. Also, Kyle Kyleson is once again home alone with my infant. Slept through the night milestone, though. Let's go, Sage. Where's Kyle? Feed me. Kyle. Help. No, are you leaving? He's leaving. He's literally like, bye. I woohooed your mom. I'm out. Uh, I cannot believe it. <laughs> he dined and dashed. Oh my god. Hey, look. Oh. Someone didn't have a good first day of school. Ugh. What did I miss? Oh my god, you missed it. Kyle Kyleson autonomously woohooed a uh, pedal on Winterfest. I cannot believe it. All right, why don't you two go play pretend together? Let's play Fairy Tale Castle with Aster. Go on, you're gonna have fun. It'll be a good time. Yeah, they'll make friendship bracelets too. I'm thinking maybe this weekend. Yeah, we got time. We got time before Aster ages up. Potter and Malfoy home at last. You know what? I didn't even intend to make them look anything like Harry Potter characters, but he is wearing Harry Potter glasses and this kid does look like Draco Malfoy. I'm just going to point it out. Hey, Petal, I've been thinking about getting to know Mila Flex better as a friend. Do you think the two of us should hang out? I don't care what you do. One time my Sims parent died and the mom woohooed the, with Father Winterfest at my house. Oh my god. The drama. The tea. Alright, I want to watch them play pretend together. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Scritches for Olivia. Hey, welcome, Sloth. What's up? You two need to have fun together. Fairy tale castle.
The little music that plays is so cute. Okay, Everett's home from work. Did we get promoted? Not yet. Why, do, why are we not promoted? We need logic skill level five. All right. Babble milestone unlocked. Oh my god. Sage started babbling. Maybe we can get her to say her first word. Also, little home record. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Oh, where's my cat? Olivia? Where'd she go? I don't know where she went. Oh, she's eating. Sorry. I literally went to give her scritches and I'm like, there's nothing here. I too am a home wrecker. I just started a 100 baby challenge on my YouTube channel and I the first thing I did was make a married man woohoo me. So I'm a bad person. Um Is that Kyle who just followed? Oh my god, I'm dead. Kyle, is that you? Why are my Sims not finishing their food by the way? They're just like leaving empty plates. It's kind of nasty. Why are we still so tense? We, we need to have more fun. Should we go swing together? Will you swing with me? I'm feeling really tense. Also, why won't they go down the slide? Do I need to like... Slide down treehouse slide. There we go. Pedals home. My goodness, Bree. Back at it again with the puns. Okay, we're getting a diaper change. Uh, Petal, you can actually give Sage the bath because I need Everett to work on his logic skills. So we're going to have him go observe the sky for a bit. They get summoned by Sage, so they stop eating. That's so annoying. I think like the infants have a little bit too much power. I don't know. Oh, that's a burrito blanket and her fur. Good question. It's covered in her fur right now. Are you going to put the baby on the ground outside next to your telescope? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, someone's not having a good day. That is concerning, to say the least. Oh my gosh, wait! Did we do that school drawing on our first day of school? Stop. I'm gonna cry. That is so freaking cute. We drew a little unicorn. That's not what our brother drew. Our brother drew this on his first day of school. So that's so fun. They each draw different things. I love that. I love that so much. Why are you going to throw up? Are you going to throw up from the swing? Oh my god. Oh, he went down the slide. That's so cute. I'm going to delete that because that's really annoying. I need you to do your homework. Okay, also, I have to use the bathroom really quick, chat. Are you cool if I go to the bathroom for a minute and I'll be right back and we'll keep playing for a bit? I just have to pee really bad. Also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Scritches for Olivia. No? Okay, little Dika said no, so I guess I'll just die. <laughs> um, Yeah, I'll be right back, you guys. In the meantime, if you're enjoying the stream, don't forget to hit the follow button. And... um. I'll be back in a couple minutes. Also, check out my YouTube channel. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. More scritches. Okay, I'll have Olivia watch you. I'll be right back. Olivia, you're going to watch chat, okay? Okay, I'm back, everyone. Thanks for waiting. Okay. Whew. Shall we continue? Did she watch you? I bet she was watching you so closely. All right, we're just going to keep looking at the sky. We need to get our logic skill up, so. Hey, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Scritches for Olivia. Oh my god. Had an affair? Shut up. 
Petal had an affair with Kyle Carlson. I cannot believe. I was trying so hard to not make this happen. Chat kept being like, you can have an affair, it's fine. And I literally didn't. They did it autonomously. And now it's on my milestone forever. Oh my God. Wow. I cannot believe this. <laughs> and he'll never know. That's so sad, actually, when you think about it. Also, thank you for the follows. Welcome in, friends. It's not what you think, okay? It's not what you think. I'm going to try to practice talking with uh, Sage tomorrow, I think. She deserves all the treats and scratches. She really does. She gets spoiled. Um, what's wrong with you? Oh, you got a poop really bad. And you're kind of hungry and sleepy. Well, that sucks. Um, I'm gonna have her just poop her pants, I guess. No, maybe, I don't know if I can. Yeah, chat warned me about the tooth glitch. Um... Thankfully, Aster already lost a tooth, so I think he's in the clear. Oh my god. My lads out here are stinking it up. But we'll have to we'll have to keep an eye out just in case. Oh, trusting the universe. The world is a good place filled with good people. Aster is happy to call some of them family. That's so nice. Poop in the tub. When's her birthday? Actually, her birthday's tomorrow. So that's why I'm hoping I can get her to talk before we eat her up. So I think that'd be really fun. Um. Oh, now he's losing another tooth? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. How do I how do I get her to poop her pants? Use diaper. Use your diaper. The way the eldest child has always been stinky. I know. He's literally always so smelly. Okay, poop your pants, and then I'm going to change you. Oh, there's a diaper on the ground. There we go. Um. Okay, he's going to go take a tub. You're falling asleep? No, I need you to poop your pants first. You don't get to sleep right now. My child sim lost three teeth on normal lifespan. Oh, really? So it can happen more than once. Your sim was completely missing the skin texture. Uh-oh. Okay, you know what? I'm going to say you pooped your pants. Fine, I'll just put you... You know what? Go to bed. It's too much for me. I can't handle it. I'm stressed. <laughs> Sage is so difficult. Yeah, she's an intense infant, so... She is very hard to handle. That's for sure. Okay, you got your logic to level five. So you can get promoted. Very good, Everett. I'm going to have you feed our cow plant. Good night. I hope you sleep well. How old is Olivia? She's seven. She's just a baby. Okay, you're going to do the gardening stuff because Petal is busy. I had to reset Petal. I don't know why. She was like bugged. I'm just gonna fix my food need to. I'm sorry, you guys. I just can't handle it. <laughs> it's too much stress for me. Like I was trying to fix the needs there for like three sim hours and it just wasn't working. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. My sim also lost skin texture, and then I had to roll back to a save three hours earlier. Oh, are you talking about when you aged your sims up to teenagers, they lost their skin texture? Really? See, that seems a bit extreme to me. I hope they fix that. Is that a glitch for custom content? I don't actually know. I haven't seen any of the glitches yet. I haven't had any teens. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Hi, Shaney. I'm great. How's it going? 
Okay, did we finish taking care of the garden? Okay. We did good. We're going to go talk to Forest, I suppose. Yeah, I heard about the legacy box glitch. I have one of the boxes in here, but I haven't used it yet because of that glitch. I'm too afraid to, so. All right, go potty and then go to bed. See what's happening. What's happening? Huh? What do you mean, see what's happening with your sister? Nothing's happening. She's just sleeping. I look gorgeous today. Oh my gosh, you're so nice. What the heck? I love your sim designs. Oh, thank you. I will say I made both Petal and uh, Everett, and I think they had some really cute kids. So pat myself on the back for that one. When are we going to do another Among Us stream? Um, On the 31st. We wanted to do Among Us on a Friday this month, and unfortunately, the last Friday of the month was the one that worked the best for all of us. So it's definitely been a long time since we've done our last Among Us stream. But 31st is what we have planned. The way that we decide is we'll do like a poll and see like the majority day that most of us can make it. So, yep, that is how that's done. I'm gorgeous every day. Okay, I'm not sure about that. I don't know. Why are you sleeping? Everest does not like sleeping with me anymore. Everett is like, this is not... He just does not like sleeping with me. Do you think he secretly knows about my affair? He's acting really sus. You think it glitched because they're custom content? Yeah, I definitely know there's a bug there, so I'd just be careful. You can smell Kyle's juice on me. Oh, that is true. Kyle does drink energy juice all the time, so maybe he spilled some of his juice on me. That's possible. Makes sense. Yeah, family friendly. Hmm. Huh. You should have a milestone for cheating. Oh, I do. We have an affair milestone that I didn't even want. Had an affair with Kyle Kyleson. Can't believe this. Y'all wanted this to happen the whole time. I hope you're happy. You got what you wanted. I love the kitchen double sink design. Oh, thank you. This house is on my gallery if you ever want to play in it. Feel free. You all really manifested it. You really did. You like forced it to happen. I'm very happy. Thanks. Great. Did Petal learn her lesson about eating cake from a cow plant? Um, we'll find out. All right. Humble Borp Sage. Kids have school today. Chat with Aster. Do you all want to make a friendship bracelet? right now let's do a rainbow one before school i think that could be really fun um and maybe you can tell a make-believe story to your sibling there we go milestones for the hunter baby challenge is gonna be wild yeah it's gonna be crazy i want them to exchange friendship bracelets so I'm excited about that. Exchange friendship bracelets with Aster. Here we go. I haven't done this yet. Can we agree that Everett's the innocent one now? Honestly, yeah. Do you want to exchange friendship bracelets with me, bro? I made this for you. I want to get both sides of it. They both made rainbow ones. <gasps> He's wearing it! <laughs> I bet, I bet Forrest is wearing it too. That just made me so happy. Put on your normal clothes. Put on your normal clothes. I want to get pictures with of the boys together. 
That makes me so happy. They have little brother friendship bracelets. Oh my god. That's so exciting. Can I? Uh, it's seven. I guess I'll I'll do pictures maybe on the weekend. That's literally so freaking cute. Joke about boogers. Yeah, that's good. I like that. That's a good one. Oh yeah, is this my picture of Sage? <gasps> Ooh, Astra can't stop laughing. That fo that joke Forrest told him was way too good. After being dazzled by that marvelous bit of humor, Astra is thinking about jokes and how great they can be for a conversation. Is this a moment of realization that Astra likes jokes? Um, yeah. That was a good one. I love booger jokes. I'm trying to see... Where's the picture of me with, um... With my daughter. <gasps> oh, you guys. That's a good one. I feel like we can add another one of these in here. I want to make a little gallery wall. There we go. Us with all the kids? Are you kidding me? Maybe I'll, I'll get the smaller version of this picture. There we go. That is so cute. <laughs> the handprint? I know. We have Sage's handprint. That's the only one we have, unfortunately, because we, um... Aged up the kids, like, before I had the update. So. All right, everyone's going off to work in school. Hi, Christine. How are you? Dang it, I can't access my inventory anymore. I just want this to be a really cute, like, gallery wall moment. Uh-oh. Oh, it's going to slot to this uh, shelf, so I'm going to move this shelf for now. Look at how cute. The handprint is so cute and small. I know. I'm literally obsessed. We got to add in some, like, other pictures here, too. So I'll have to look and see which other ones we have. That's illegal. What, what are you doing? Do? How do you fix the broken pumpkin with a pumpkin patch? Oh, my God. Free. Uh, oh, this was the gift that uh, Forrest got from Father Winter. We got like a train. I like trains. So I guess I'll just uh, put that in here. Also, um, we stole this from class. A Victorian lady. Uh, don't really know why. Aster decided to steal this, but we did. So there we go. I added Kyle to my family and he has no skills. I thought that he had like a really high knitting skill. Does he not? I can't get that out of there. Are you for real? Kyle Kyleson in his stupid chip bowl. Have you seen the new photo frames that came with a the pack? They'd be so cute for those photos. I did, but I don't know. Can I not clean that up? I don't know if uh, if they'll fit the photos that I took. I don't know if it's just me or not. But um, the photos I took are, are really big. And like I tried to slot them in one time and it didn't work. So I'm a little confused. Is our bestie Kyle still at the house? Oh. Christine. Kyle is not in the house. Do you want to know what he did before he left? I didn't do this. This was autonomous. I 
I literally looked and Kyle woohooed her in the bathroom right in front of Everett while Everett was sleeping on the couch. I literally cannot believe this. <laughs> oh, hi, Egg. Yeah, the drama is unreal. It's literally unreal. Also, Morgue redeeming Hobgoblin. Let me take care of that quickly. One moment. Can we get a Mahab in the chat? Oh, that's not what I need. At Morgue. I'm hoping this is you. Yes, okay. Welcome to the Hobgoblins, Mahab. But yeah, like, I literally cannot tell you all how shocked I was. I hope someone clipped it, because that's going to be good for the highlight reel. Can I still not grab those chips? These Kyle chips are haunting me. I'll put them on the table. Why can't I clean up the Kyle chips? You clipped it? Okay, good. The freaking Kyle chips, man. All right, today is Sage's birthday, by the way, so she is going to be aging up before the end of the day. Work hard. Does she get pregnant from it? No, we do have Risky Woohoo on, so I was extremely nervous that we would get pregnant, but we did not get pregnant, so. <sighs> Here they are! Wait, are they? Okay, they're still wearing their friendship bracelets. That's good. They're both not in a good mood today, though. Not good. Go do something fun, and you go take a bath. It's already in Discord? Perfect. <sighs> can we watch the clip together? Yeah, do you all want to see the Kyle clip? I can show it to you. Everybody sit back and relax. I think three is enough. Are you ready? Let me mute my music really quick. I think three is enough. Whoa, are we talking to Kyle? Did he just flirt with us? They're going into the bathroom. Oh! They're going into the bathroom. Oh my God. Oh my God, no, are you kidding me? Oh my God. Whoa! My boyfriend's literally right there on the couch. I think three is enough. So yeah. Whoa, are we talking to Kyle? I literally didn't make that happen. So. Did he just flirt with us? <laughs> yeah. So if you missed it, there you go. Yeah, neither of them were flirty. Neither of them had any romance bar with each other. I flirted with Kyle once just for fun. And, like, it didn't give us any romance. So I was like, okay, whatever. That was the only romantic interaction that I had with Kyle. <laughs> no, I don't have naps on. I don't. I always turn naps off. So anyways, I do have MC Woohoo, which I think means that Sims will be able to Woohoo with each other a lot easier. So that's probably why. But, like, I think that's funny. So that's why I like it. It's like a OMG setting. So yeah. Uh-oh, the cow plant's hungry. Uh-oh. Oh no, we can't let Mufasa die. Are one of my parents coming home soon? I hope so. We're still really tense. We had a bad day at school. We're not thriving. Can you clean out the spoiled food though? If she would have gotten pregnant, I would have been mortified because we don't have space for another child. That made your night? Okay, good. Oh, we got promoted to conservation director. Uh-oh, Sage is about to be taken away. Okay, I have to feed my cow plant and then I'll feed my infant. You might be thinking, that's a bit backwards, Shella. Don't worry about it. Or, I don't know, are you going to make me feed the infant first? No, okay, good. Yeah, she's going to be taken away. It's fine, I'm feeding her now. Cow plate is top priority. What do you mean you can't feed her? Also, Petal's home. 
Wake up. I need to feed you. Wake up. Try first baby food in the high chair. Oh, we could do that. We could do that. That's fun. I'm going to give her like the tiniest little boost to her food though. I said I wanted to try to feed her in the high chair. Why are we not? Are you for real? Is Petal blocking us with tummy time right now? No. I want to do high chair. Let's try applesauce. Sage's onesie is everything. I know. Isn't she so cute? Yeah, it's really safe for her to be like on the floor by the stairs. Don't worry about it. She's fine. Everett, can you go shave your founding father beard actually? No, you're too tense. Okay, well, let's try to fix that. Everyone is so tense in the household today. Also, I want you to change your outfit away from this ugly, <laughs> ugly outfit that you wear to work. All right, let's try applesauce. She's like, mother, I will literally end you. What is that? Oh my God, are you kidding me? You guys, we're doing it. Do you like it? Such a cute place to pause, right? Oh, I think she likes it. Oh no, she disliked it. Okay. Okay, she hates it. I'm gonna miss her. She ages up today. Can I practice talking with you yet? Talk to Sage. I want Sage to say her first words. That's like what I really want. So cute. My not so very sim is looking for love. My career legacy fell in love with a werewolf named Rory. The Rory. Nice. Also, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Thank you. I want to teach her how to talk. Is that how you get her to talk? Is just like chatting? Oh, you like your little sister too, don't you, buddy? You're so sweet. Are you hanging out with the cow plan out here? Outshined from watching siblings milestone? That's it? Big deal. Astra's been doing that for years. Oh my god, he's jealous? Of Sage having her first food? Oh my god. Big brother drama. You did not shave your founding father beard, Everett. Come on. Come on. Get rid of that. Um, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Scritch is for Olivia. I don't know how to make her freaking talk. I guess I just have to keep talking to her. Sage's first word's gonna be affair. Not this. Your sim blew a kiss. Oh my god, that's so cute. Please, I just want you to talk. My child sim got the bitter sentiment towards their parent for paying more attention to the infant. Oh my god. Whoa, that drool. That's some crazy drool, girl. Yeah, I, I fed the kid applesauce and she hated it, so there's that. Let's go take a nap. Say just first sentences, I know what you did. <laughs> they actually do that in base game, which is pretty cool. Really? Oh, I love that. It's nap time. No, you're not going to leave that here. Clean that up, young man. Oh, well, we got to enjoy this moment while it lasts. This is probably the last time we'll be holding our little infant, you guys. Slipping through my fingers all the time. Okay, cool thing, Kyle. Welcome back. I'm juicing that update before I purchase the DLC on payday. Let's go. All right, I'm going to go put her in a crib. And then I'll probably age her up 
when she wakes my sims keep trying to move the baby when i just want it to nap yeah i feel like that's really annoying it's like you put the kid down for a nap and then your sim goes and picks it up and you're like are you freaking kidding me i literally just got the kid to sleep and now you're waking them up again is he sleeping in the treehouse again wait what the heck is happening forest buddy you can't sleep in the pool No. No. He's vibing. I can't believe this. Also, yeah, Everett is sleeping in the treehouse again. I really... He does not want to sleep in the bed with me. I don't know what I did to him. <laughs> but he's like, I will do anything except sleep in a bed with my girlfriend. I hate her. <laughs> Maybe he knows about Kyle. Whoa, where am I going? Get out of the wall. He has no cares. How do I get my infants to work? They disappear in the game. Uh, what do you mean? What? I don't know what that means. They disappear? You can't take your infants to work with you if that's what you're asking. Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in just for olivia their relationship is crumbling i know the drama is unreal the kid has a sixth sense yeah sage knows everything i'm gonna have to aid i'm gonna have to wake her up and age her up otherwise i think that um she'll probably feel forgotten right oh my gosh thank you for the reset for 14 months silly kids i appreciate it Dr. Gluon had that glitch as well. They just disappear. Oh? Like your sims actually just disappear? Um, that's weird. I haven't had that glitch. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. What is going on? Christina, thank you for the seven months. I appreciate it. What in the sub hype train is happening? Saki gifting a sub to Sleepy. Thank you so much. You're so sweet. You don't have to do that. What the heck? I appreciate it. All right, let's change Sage's diaper and then age her up. What in tarnation? Usually a corrupt save file will make Sims disappear. Oh, dear. I hope that uh, your save files aren't corrupt. That's always the worst. I haven't had that glitch yet, and I really hope I don't. All right, everybody, say goodbye to Infant Sage. It's time to age this baby up. Um, also, thanks for redeeming scritches for Olivia. Thank you. Bye, Infant Sage. I'm aging her up angry. Okay, manifesting a toddler trait. I'm really... Fingers crossed for independent. If I get a fussy toddler after an intense infant, I think I'm doomed. So. Whoa, Emmy. Oh my gosh. You don't have to do that. Thank you. Thank you for gifting five community subs. Let's freaking go. Infant hype. Infant hype. Fussy. Little Dika, die. Don't tell me. Don't manifest fussy. Oh my god. Thank you, Emmy. I hope everyone enjoys their emotes and ad free viewing. Okay, here we go. Silly. Okay, I can deal with silly. Girl. Oh my gosh, her hair. Wow. Oh my gosh. Hamlets, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you so much. She had a bunch of hair growing. All right, let's go give her a toddler makeover. Thank you. Are there any new toddler hairs with the pack, though? I want to check. Oh, I would like to check. Just in case. La 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 la. Okay, we have this one. And this one. So, I probably won't use these. I would like to keep her textured hair. I kind of want to go to this one, though, because she had the little fun buns when she was uh, an infant. So I think it'd be cute to just like 
continue the fun buns into her toddler stage. I think that's adorable. Fun buns for the win. Um, also, thank you for the bits, Alex. And thanks for the follow welcoming. Scritch is for Olivia. Thank you. All right, let's give her some cute little outfits. It looks like she's wearing blue, which is good because I like blue on her. She has blue eyes. And also, I had her in a blue cloud dress. But I'm guessing there's not cloud outfits for toddlers. These are so cute, though. Are you kidding me? Wow. I think we'll go with this one, maybe. I like that. Oh my god, there's new toddler shoes, too. Oh my god. God, look at how cute she is. Little Sage. She's just a little guy. He's just a baby. Um, I think we'll probably just do a cute little dress. Another blue color. That's kind of more green, though. Hi, Maroon. What's up? Her little nose is so cute. I know. She looks adorable. She got her mama's eye color. I honestly, I can't tell when she's a toddler what shape her eyes are either. Because um, Everett and Daisy have, or Petal have very different eye shapes. This is like Everett eye shape on Aster. And then this is Forest uh, eye shape. Uh, Petal, Petal gave Forest their eye shape. So I'm curious to see which one Sage has when she ages up. Yeah, she looks a lot like dad. She sure does. How stinking cute. Um, how's everyone's day? I'm doing great, Kiv. How are you? Welcome in. Also, thanks for the follow. Welcome. Some more scritches for Olivia. I'm just going to give her maybe these Jimmy Jammies. Little llamas. I think those are cute. Alrighty, let's do our party outfits. Um, I feel like I'll never see the party outfit, so I'm just going to put her in a random dress <laughs> and call it good because I, I doubt we'll ever see it. Maybe one of these, actually. Yeah. Cheetah socks and ladybug shoes. That is definitely... <gasps> oh, they have little sneakers. Oh my god, shut up. I can't handle it. It's too much for me. It's too much. Those are so cute. Oh my gosh. Making some dinner. What's for dinner? I feel like I've never seen this swimsuit before. Maybe I have. Oh, just not the swatch. Okay, that makes sense. Um, Cat no, holy cannoli! Thank you for gifting a... Uh, what is that? Five subs? Oh my gosh, thank you. I really appreciate it. I hope everyone enjoys their emotes and ad-free viewing. Um, I'm heading to bed now. Good night, Louise. See you later. I love that all the kids are different skin tones, but you can definitely see their parents in them. I know. I think the genetics are really, really good with this family. You can honestly, you can stay in that. That's fine. I don't care. I want to give her, I want to give her the new outfit. Show me. Where is it? Where are you? Here it is. Oh my gosh. That looks a little... Oh, maybe that's not hot weather enough. I don't know. It looks like she might get hot in that. So I think I'll change it. Um. Also, thank you for the bits, Alex. I really, really appreciate it. We don't actually know who the heir is going to be yet. We haven't decided. Um, Out of all the kids which one of them we would like to see be the heir, so we don't actually know. Piggy or deer? What do you think, chat? Piggy or deer? Uh, my day's been good, a little tiring, but I'm relaxing to play and watch some Twitch. I just finished your Sims and Bloom episodes. You've already posted on YouTube. Oh, thank you. Well, welcome in. 
Also, Autism Kindness, thanks for the follow. Scritches for Olivia, welcome in. Oh my gosh, I think most people are saying deer. So I'm going to leave it on deer. That was kind of hard to tell, though, I will say. There's a lot of chats. I think that this will be cute, though. Honestly, I think she could rock anything. That's adorable. I'm going to give her uh, a hat, too. A little, maybe... Hmm... Maybe that one. I think that's cute. She's literally so adorable. Okay, well, that's Sage. So we're good there. I might give her some freckles, too. I don't know. I just think that since her mom has freckles, maybe... Maybe she would have freckles, too. We haven't gotten any Sims that have, like, birthmarks, either. I wonder if it will autonomously happen. Is she making you enjoy yellow? No. I still hate yellow. So cute! Alright, so this is our Sims family, by the way, in case you're new here. This is Everett. Oh my god, of course you're wearing that. I'm gonna take his back hair off, too. Because I didn't give him back hair. It's just there. Why is that there? Enable hair growth. I don't know why that's on. Uh, but this is Everett. This is our, this is the boyfriend. This is our main Sim Petal. She's our heir. She's our legacy founder for the Sims in Bloom. And we love her a lot. She's an icon. Uh, this is our firstborn son, Aster, who is adorable. Loves frogs, loves dinos. Uh, this is our next child, Forrest, who uses he, they pronouns. Super into animals. And I really like Forrest outfits. I think they're very, like fashionable um very pastel vibes also we gave him little shoulder freckles which i think is adorable um uh, can i do shoulder freckles on sage this is sage our youngest so let me check oh, i think i can oh, i think i can what where to go where are you oh that's kind of fun should we change the teeth? We can change the teeth. I don't mind. I don't know. They don't hiss at you when they're toddlers. Uh, Leo, thank you for the 100 bits. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize we're in a level 4 hype train, you guys. Almost level 5. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, there's freckles. There's body freckles. Also, yeah, uh, Petal has had three kids. So Petal has stretch marks and a uh, C-section scar. Um, because that happens when you have kids, so, you know. Also, I don't know what's happening. Do we have, like, silver leg hair? Why? No. I'll... It's fine. Whoa! Wait, what's happening? Holy cannoli! Uh, Birch Bunny, thank you for gifting a sub as well to the community. Uh... Sil Silvanara, thank you for gifting 100 bits. Uh, Soint, thank you for the 100 bits. And Little Dika gifting five subs. Stinky, gross, disgusting I'm sorry if I butchered names, by the way. I tend to be bad at that, so <laughs> that's my bad. Um, but thank you all. What the heck? She's dyeing her leg hair. Yeah, I don't know how that happened. Oh, no, no. I nailed it? Okay, good. Oof. Alex, thank you for the 200 bits as well. Oh my gosh, you guys. Did we just beat a level 5 hype train in this economy? In this economy? I don't know about that, but that means we have another 5 minute sketch. <laughs> so next stream, remind me, we have a, an extra 5 minute sketch to do. Oh, no. Um. Whoa, what? <laughs> Love for all peoples, thank you for the 100 bits as well. Um, and also a first time sub from Juniper Island. Juniper's eyelids. Thank you so much. Enjoy your emotes and ad reviewing, but most importantly, enjoy your new smile. Very good. Very, very good. There's so much happening right now. Thank you all so much. We need to give uh, our kid a bedroom makeover. Did we steal more dirty dishes? I think we did. God dang it. 
need to stop doing that. It's time to stop. I want to keep the cloud theme. Is that even legal? But I think I'm just going to delete and buy a new toddler bed. I know I can like edit it, but I don't want to wait because my sim's sleeping right now. So, K Brown, thank you for the 300 bits. Thank you guys. Really appreciate all the support. How long do I plan on streaming today? Um, honestly, I'm thinking about ending here pretty soon because I'm getting a little bit hungry. But I definitely want to finish this first. Do you think it's weird to do her bed like this by the window? So I don't have to ruin anything else in the nursery? I don't know. Sage is also hungry. Yeah, she's like starving. I think it's cute. Yeah, okay. I think it's cute too. I like it. And we still have the changing table in there because, um, you know, it's perfect. Okay. I like it. I like it a lot. So I'll, I'll keep it like that. I just really like her little, her little cloud bedroom. It's so cute. I want to put these like, no, these. But I feel like it's blocked anyways. No. Yeah, that's dumb. You can change the toddlers on the changing table too. Yeah, that's why I'm going to keep it. Because I figure we're probably still using it. Perfect! I like it. I like it. I think I'm going to leave the bed there. I like it being in the center of the window like that. And it makes sense that they just like deconstructed the crib. That was sitting there and they were like, let's not even move it. It's fine there. All right, come and get a serve serving of this. Oh my gosh, you guys, <laughs> I feel very overwhelmed right now. I'm trying to play it cool, but I am feeling very grateful for everyone's love and support. But also, I'm trying to play it cool, so thanks, I guess. <laughs> okay okay everything's fine yeah i made everett go to the bed he wasn't in there earlier let me tell you you're so stinking cute sage she still looks a little demonic you're so cool thank you thank you i appreciate it no level five hype train level five hype train oopsie baby with Kyle. No. I'm not gonna have an oopsie baby for a level five hype train. No, that's not how this works. Yes, yeah, Sage is like, I see you. <laughs> she has a very intense energy. You don't have to go put the plate anywhere. Okay, well thank you. I appreciate you doing that. Night on the town was awful. Grow up. Grow up. All right. And there we have it. Sage going to bed and the whole family is now tucked away. We did it. We had a successful, um, a successful day today, you guys. Wow. Everything in my house still looks dead. Even the cow plant outside. Sage is the wild but adorable type. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. That's why Sage's hair was so big when she aged up. It's full of her mom's secrets. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. <laughs> oh my god. I cannot believe. Today was wild. I can't believe half the things happened that happened. An affair with Kyle Carlson. I, w I literally was not going to do it. I was like, no, I'm not having an affair. I want my family to be happy. And then Petal was like, actually, I want to have an affair. So I guess we did. Um, anyways, that's really exciting. We don't have any toddler. Oh, we learned how to walk. We had a lot of toddler or infant milestones with Sage. I never got the slept through the night one yet. That one was cool. Um, also lifting head. We learned how to sit and stuff. Yeah, we had an affair. Oh my god, if you missed it, <laughs> I'm probably going to edit a clip of it, but, um, we had an affair with Kyle. Kyle Kyleson. So, yeah. Anyways. 
Oh my gosh. Have fun, Spice. Petal said if you liked it, he should have put a ring on it. Yeah. It was the last day he was here, too. He was like, bye. I can't believe that's a milestone. I mean, it makes sense, doesn't it? It's a huge life-changing event to have an affair. Oh. Oh my god. Whew. What a day. What a day. Yeah, what a parting gift. Yeah, he left because it got awkward. They were like, ooh, this is weird now. Um, Dang, you guys. What the heck? This was a really fun uh, episode. I can't wait to get this posted. Um, it's going to be a little bit behind. Here's the thing that happens. Whenever I start Let's Plays, I literally play them every single day. And there's like a huge backup um, that I have to wait to post to YouTube. So episode two just got posted this morning. And this is obviously episode five. So there's like a couple of episodes that are still waiting to be uploaded. Um but also I'm not going to spam them. I'm going to upload them little by little. So it will be fine. The day will come where I'm not playing with this Let's Play every day and I'll be able to catch up and keep it more consistent. But uh, since the pack just came out, I'm obviously going to spam it every day. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping either tomorrow or Tuesday. Wait, Tuesday is tomorrow. I'm hoping to upload the next 100 baby episode tomorrow, but if I don't get it edited, I will upload episode three of Sims in Bloom. And then on Wednesday, I plan to upload Not So Berry. Um, we'll just have to see. I don't know what my schedule is going to look like. So it's just going to be kind of crazy. So <laughs> we'll see what happens. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to get a Not So Berry episode in this week. So. Our cup runneth over. Yeah, expect videos from me literally every single day for a while. So subscribe on YouTube for more. Um, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Zoo's day. Yeah, we're going to play Planet Zoo tomorrow. Tomorrow, uh, I will not be streaming The Sims. I'll be streaming a game called Planet Zoo. So if you've never seen that before, it's really fun. I think I need a little bit of a Sims break so I don't get burnout. So we're going to go back and work on our zoo together. It's going to be fun. Um, so yeah, it'll be a good time. Zoo's day, Tuesday, and then on Wednesday, we'll be back with our legacy family. So it'll be like, you never missed it. Um, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. What rules am I following? Uh, that's a good question. I'm not following any rules for infants at the moment. I'm kind of just figuring it out as I go along. Pretty much so far, I've just been aging them up whenever they age up naturally. So... Discorf. Discorf. But yeah, join Discord for more information. I post my schedule in Discord, so that's a good place to be. Uh, subscribe to YouTube for more. Uh, we're honestly, I'm getting a lot of subscribers on YouTube recently. So thank you all so much. It really means a lot. And I hope you're enjoying the content. Um, but yeah, it's going to be fun. I'll see you all tomorrow for Zoo's Day Tuesday. Uh, also, feel free to follow me on my other socials. We'll put some links in chat, but we're going to go raid someone now, if you all don't mind. Let's see who's live. But yeah, I'm excited for Zoo's Day Tuesday tomorrow. Um, oh my gosh. Everyone I know plays The Sims. <laughs> all my friends are playing The Sims right now. So many people are doing the 100 Infants Challenge. That's crazy. All right. Um. Hmm. The question is, is who to raid today? You know what? I'm going to make sure this person isn't getting offline. I don't think they are. So I want to go raid my friend, uh, Gypsy Daisy, who is doing the 100 or no. It says infant undertaking. So I don't know if that means 100 infant challenge or not, but I guess we'll find out when we go over there. I have not raided Gypsy in a while, so I really want to do this. Um, make sure to say hello, make sure to drop a follow, all those things, be nice. And uh, I will catch you all tomorrow for some Zoo's Day Tuesday. Bye for now. Thank you for watching my YouTube video. I don't know what I'm singing. This is my outro, but thanks. See you next time. Love you. Bye.